hi everyone so in this video i'm going to show you how you can actually run your aspace database inside your windows pc we will not use any virtual machine we will directly run this kind of program inside our windows pc we just use a simple software to run this so for this you need to go to my video description and here you will get this link to this page this is the doc the software that we are going to use for this purpose so here you can see this is the url given inside my description you can just copy and paste this in a browser here i am using the chrome browser so i just paste it and come to this page from here you just need to click on this download docker desktop for windows you need to download this to download the software you just need to click on this docker desktop for windows so i just click here and you can see it will automatically open a pop-up to download and you just save this so i have already downloaded this you can see here this is the 526 megabyte software so i just click on open to open this software so this installation is very simple you just need to download and open the software and it will automatically start installing your software but it will need a internet connection uh, to complete this it will basically take about 10 minutes so you can see once i open this it will automatically start installing so you can see here so once you complete uh, this download and installing uh, after that you need to restart the pc so as i have already installed it i just close this installation and i will show you the interface of the software so uh, i have already installed the docker and restart the pc and here if i just open this uh, this is our the icon for the docker and we can run this inside our windows environment so this is our software and once you are successfully run you can see this option here engine is running first of all when you open the environment you will not get this option this is base uh, as i have already installed this inside this that's why it's here but we'll i will show you how you can actually get this ace based environment inside this docker app so for this we just need to go to our start menu and from here we just need to search for command this this app we need to open this one so here we need to write some lines of code to locate our ace base inside our docker d-o-c-k-e-r docker search ace now you can see so this is our address for the ace base installation so we just need to copy this and now we will write another line of code here that will be docker docker pool so here we are using the pool method to install the ace base inside our pc and now we will give the address and we will also declare the version what version we are going to use so we will use the ace base 1.3 and now press enter the first time when you run this on your pc it will take some time and it will download about 200 megabytes of file from internet but it will instantly complete on my pc you can see image is up to date on my pc already installed the ace base 1.3 but if you run this on your pc it will automatically start downloading for internet so you need to have internet connection on your pc and once you are done downloading this then it will just stop like this now again we need to do another installation or another code uh, run here we need to now run the installation to insert it inside our docker so when you first run the code it will show like this inside our pc this 236 megabyte software but it will not show up in this place but basically we can run the software from here you can see this is the icon so we just again go to the terminal and from here we need to write, write a code i will give all the code and source file inside my description so you can just go to this so from here you just need to paste this code here so this is the line and the docker run slash d dash dash name is base this code and now press enter so once you run this code it will automatically insert container apps inside the docker now you can see this is our already installed here so for this uh, you need to run this code and you can see this docker app from here now our environment is completely set up for running the software and docker application so i just close the terminal now here uh, from here we can run the ace base and that's all you need to do this is very easy and after you install everything you just need to restart your pc so once you are done you can just click on this uh, open in browser from here you can see the terminal and everything uh, where you will run the localhost code you can see this is our localhost and here you can see the table that we have created i have already have a table here and i will show you some basic 
instruction how you can run some code here now we will go to our terminal you can also run the terminal from this from this docker now we just go to this terminal section here this is our the docker terminal from here we can write is base shell and now press enter it will take some time to load up the is base all done now you can just simply write an instruction and create a new table so i will show you some uh, instruction how you can create a table inside this is base just a basic create table function so we'll now create a simple table inside our this is base so i just write the create now we give our table name test table and we'll our uh, column name or row name how we want so i will create one column so i will just use personal data so that's it our create table have completed you can see inside this table section here you can see this test table have created so that's all you can now run all kind of age based code inside of this thank you for watching my tutorial see if the video help hit the like button and do subscribe to my channel for more videos like this i'll see you guys on the next video